friends. I'm going to pull a couple cards today from our private, our Blue Heavens deck, and let's see what we get. Why are you allowing your ego mind to take over your thoughts, feelings, and emotions? Okay, boom. Did you know that you can control your thoughts? You can, you are actually in control of that. You can do something about that. So if you're like off in space thinking about terrible things, you can wrangle that shit in and you can think of something better. So maybe you didn't know that. So are you allowing things to just go like on autopilot? Pay attention to your thoughts. That's good advice. Let's see what our second one is. Why are you holding on to all this anger? Like anger is like a uh, the glue that cements us to our past like it keeps us stuck someplace that we don't want to be anymore so are you angry why let that shit go think of what could you gain from letting it go and what are you cheating yourself of by holding on to anger all right one more let's see what we get this one fell out your divine team is waiting for you to ask for help I got this one the other day. So people need to know that, did you know that you can communicate with God, with your spirit team? This ask and you shall receive is true, is reality, like it's manifestation. So say what you want, ask your spirit team for help, whatever it is, if, if, if you feel alone, if you feel sad, ask for help and then follow whatever guidance you receive. So we also have our own like a 555 affirmation card. So let's pull up uh, five affirmations that can help us today. Let's see what we get. Oh, heck yeah. We get comfort zone. One, I so here's five affirmations for your comfort zone. Let's see what we get. I welcome the unknown and trust that stepping outside my comfort zone is where growth and opportunity thrive. It's fucking true. Uh, your comfort zone is also like a cemetery or graveyard for your dreams and hopes. So that's depressing, right? Think about that. Number two, I'm not defined by my fears. Instead, I am empowered by my willingness to embrace new experiences. Awesome perspective. Three, I recognize that true magic happens outside my comfort zone and I am excited to explore my full potential. You have the potential for all kinds of like miraculous, beautiful things inside of you, but you've got to allow it and like summon it and then like release it, right? All right, number four, I release self-doubt and open myself to the endless possibilities that come from venturing beyond what's familiar. Release self-doubt. Self-doubt is like weeds growing in your garden of manifestations. So the things that you wanna create, if you have self-doubt, then it like clogs up your garden. All right, number five, I am the author of my own story and I choose to write chapters filled with bold adventures and courageous leaps. Did you know you were the author of your own story? Like we work with God, we are co-creators. We do this with the assistance of the divine. You are not alone. You are actually quite in charge and you can take charge of anything anything at all <laughs> ask for help know it's coming to you know that blue heavens loves you the creator of the freaking universe that created everything it loves you and it helps you have a wonderful black fucking friday